my gosh, Cody Smith McPhee. Hello. Hello. Good to see you. Just Hello. bamfed right in. I'm bamfing right in. I love Not that coat. Why, thank you. And the pants, everything. Yeah, Great it's, job. it's a beautiful fit. Do you always need to wear a cool color after wearing so much cool blue color? Yes, I do like to be outgoing, but in a classy way. So Jared Ang, my stylist, is helping me do that. He's also helping me out with PR, so he's double teaming it all. Well, thank you to him. Yeah, thank you, Jared. Nightcrawler in the comics and in the movies is like one of the... The X-Men is wonderful because it has multiple hearts, right? It has different pieces who are, yeah, who are so close to fans' hearts and to the team. Yes. How does it feel to be one of those hearts with Nightcrawler? It's an absolute blessing. Blessing. I mean, just like all of the fans, I relate to many of the characters and their struggles and the, the things that they conquer in many ways. I've been through many things in my life, but uh, this is one of the many things that I've conquered and, and found success and, and uh, a blessing within. So I feel honored to be a part of that. Yeah. Well, Kurt is just incredible and uh, he's so sweet, but in this film, he kicks butt big time. Does, yeah, I'm glad I got the opportunity to kind of show that side of him. And I feel like in a way it connected to the origins of the, the first class Alan Cummings portrayal that we saw. Um, in Apocalypse I got to show that more vulnerable, timid side of him, but within this and the whole tone that, you know, was more serious and emotionally driven, I got that opportunity to show a bit more of a vicious side.